Hey everyone, Brian Porter from Making a Difference TV. I just wanted to share with you my, one of my major solutions to the uh, huge mess we have right now on the planet. Everything we do, or most of what we're doing, is hurting Mother Nature. And so, one of the main solutions to all of the problems is to re start doing things local again. We all know how to grow our food local. In the process of shipping food and growing it using chemicals and GMO seed and whatnot, it's extremely bad for us. So that could be easily changed to local growing of food. Our water too could come from wells. It could be filtered after it's extracted. But again, it should be local. It's best if it's coming out of the ground versus out of lakes and waters that are uh, groundwaters that are now being uh, polluted with air pollution of various types. Uh, we'll get much more in detail into those topics on Making a Difference.tv. Uh, all our housing could be done local. Uh, I have a brilliant plan for teaching children how to build their own houses through the educational system. This should be a basic educational requirement to every child. They should know how to build a home, a tiny home, a basic starter home. Our education should be local as well. We don't need to put kids in schools and pay billions of dollars for educational services. Everything we need is on the internet. You hire a few teachers or if you create a community. If you don't want to live in a community, you will live in your own with your family. You live off the grid. You use the internet, maybe get a few children together. It's nice to have a social environment for children to learn in. Uh, it's also a good thing to have them playing as part of learning. So, but education basically, uh, no other species on earth sends their children away until they're ready to live on their own. That's called being an adult. So let's get back to nature. Let's do thing, things the natural way. Let's get around a lot of the problems that we're now experiencing with a, basically a system that, an educational system that massifies, indoctrinates our children and teaches them all sorts of lies about who they are. We all are natural beings, folks. That's the bottom line, and therefore we have to conform to Mother Nature and her laws, not the fictitious, crazy laws that we've developed over the last 6,000 years that pretty much break every rule that the Mother has for us. Similar with energy, we can create our energy, we can stop wasting energy by not insulating our homes properly, we can use homes that fit in properly with our geography, and uh, through that process, we can save a tremendous amount of energy. And actually, um, I sleep outside every night, or almost every night. Uh, you feel mother, you feel connected. It's so healthy for your uh, psyche, your mind, your body, your soul. It's, it's beyond belief. I strongly recommend, in terms of transforming back to a natural being, that you, that you sleep outside as much as you can. Cold isn't that bad, you get used to it after a while. Then, based upon this model, <clears throat> we have a variety of communities living in proximity proximity to each other, and believe me, they, this model exists. There are people doing this all over the world. You trade with the other communities based on need, and basically politics becomes a voluntary association with other communities based on needs, uh, mutual uh, respect for each other. Um, in essence, what I'm basically promoting is the indigenous way, the system that existed here before European warlords came here 500 years ago approximately and destroyed a beautiful, perfectly balanced way of life. This is the way it used to be in Turtle Island and this is the way we have to, this is the system we have to return to. We can put technology on top of it, we can add it as a layer, but because we're natural beings we have to conform to natural law in the ways of the mother. It's a very simple system, it'll, make, it'll ensure that nobody starves Everyone has the basics, everyone's loved, everyone's appreciated, everyone has a parent that loves them, that is close to them, you'll have the resources of the whole community at your disposal, and it's absolutely genius, and it's basically what we used to have before we came here and destroyed it. So let's get back to the wisdom of the indigenous people, and let's show them that we appreciate all that they've been through, and all the mistakes that we have made, and let's all start living back to 
Sneak. Over and out.